Hello. Hi, Matcha. Hi, Levo. How you doing? How are both of you? Yabba da ba da. Hello, Logan. How are you? <clears throat> We're doing something weird today. I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. Oh. The door is open. I should not talk like that. Anyway. Mm -mm. I'm gonna be a nerd today. Who's this? Hello, I would like concentric circles. I would like them here. Darn, so close. Out in the middle, pretty close. So we're gonna need that. Mm -hmm. What is the odd thing you'll be doing? I'm gonna be constructing a language today. Why? Uh, uh, I don't know. I had the idea. I want to do it. I've already done one. What's another one? Languages are cool and fun to make. What's it based off of? This one is going to be based off of magic circles. We're going to be making a magic circle language, which means we need to create a lettering system and then we need to create a grammar system based on things you would find in a magical circle, i.e. circles and lines and geometric shapes. Things like that. How do you pronounce them? Uh, in English, probably. It's just you would read them in their own way. It doesn't have to be spoken differently. But could. I want to create a non-English based language. Hmm. How much do I hate my life? How much do I hate myself? Hmm? Do I want to create a fully spoken language as well? I don't know Swahili. I need to at least be able to know what it sounds like. So best we're getting is potentially basing it loosely off English, Spanish, French, German, Japanese. I don't know the, uh, the phonetics of any other language. So those would be the limitations. But I think I'm going to do English because I don't speak that many languages. I just know the phonetics of them. A little bit. Uh, sorry. Have the recent one. No, of course, I, of course, I don't have them in recents. Do I have them in here? This folder, this folder, 
this folder, this folder. Hmm. Show it. Uh, referencing. Huh, apparently math has a like thing that it calls a magic circle. That's interesting. Anyway. Allow me to glance at references. Well, that would be a good reference if I could actually see the background. So basically, we need to figure out a lettering system. We need to figure out how those letters are placed within the circle and why. How to make them geometrically grammatical. And this is going to be a long day. Let's start off with the lettering. Okay, I don't think I actually want it. I want... That we want a one of those, and we do. This is gonna be a lot of me talking, some drawing, and me looking stuff up. Like the most common letters in the English language. All right, so we start with E, the most common letter. Why do we start with E, the most common letter? Because the most common letter should also be the easiest letter to write. What kind of style are we going for though? Stuff like that. Ye, ye. E? Sure, why not? Next, A. Will we have the vowels be the easiest. Which they are usually the most common. What are the rules, though? We have the vowels all be of a similar shape, too. So we have all vowels have this, this starting hook thing. And then differentiate themselves from there on. How do we differentiate them? Oh. 
Uh, I... Welcome to Colin Langs. This is very dumb and silly. Uh, let's see. They need to be relatively recognizable without doing anything special to them as well. Because language has ergonomics. Well, if we made the U, it's vaguely U-shaped. Why not? This is going to be a nightmare. What's next? Bell R. Something like that. E. No. Hmm. That's fine. Next. N. Uh. As long as it fits within the same sort of genre feeling. Yes. Hi, Sif. Thank you for subscribing for 37 months. That's a long time. Thank you, Sif. I appreciate it a lot. And hello. We, we are less a linguist, linguistics class and more so constructing a language. Would you like to join? Would you like to partake in constructing a magic circle based language? Honestly, that's fine, actually. Next most common, L. I'm very EP, but highly recommend Arabic characters. I mean, thing is, I'm trying to go for, like, a vertically oriented one, if that makes sense, for the most part. Like one, you know. And Arabic characters are, as someone who does not understand a lick of it, very difficult. But Sif, even if that answers my lettering problem, how, how do we handle the, the circle problem? Because the circle is going to be the grammar. We're going to geometrically do grammar.
that is acceptable to my brain. Well, let's see. Are you using a tool to make the words into a circle? Um, I don't think so. So I could very quickly make this into a into a um, font file and then figure it out from there. I don't think that there's like a follow spline tool in CSP, but I could be wrong. What was the next one? E. Sif, why am I constructing a second language? I've already made one. I don't need to make two. I want to. It'd be kind of cool if when the magic circles that are in this model are visible, that they could be red. That'd be awesome. No. No. Okay, we are far enough in that I can start adding multi part characters. E. E. We are gonna grab a snack. Okay. Make sure to stretch your wrists. Make that a little nicer. That instead. So it looks more cohesive, and you're less likely to get characters mixed up. Characters should be distinct. That was M, E, H. No, doesn't fit. anything like that so far? No. And after H, we have G.
that's fine. Next. B. Oh, there's so many letters. So many letters. Why do we have to create a design for every single one? Before we continue. It's B and K, I feel like. I want to do something. I do that. No, because then it gives the uh, dots a particular meaning, and we don't necessarily want that. But then I have to go back and change a bunch of stuff, and I, then it would barely be used. sure that nothing is matching that. Next is Y. W. Much. Nope, that is too similar to that. That's fine, though, I think. Yes. Okay.
After K, we have V. B, we have X. Don't think I have one of those. I do not. Z. Just checking something real quick to make sure I did not break a particular rule. Good, good. And then we have Q. Okay, do any of these look out of place? Not off the top of my head. All look reasonable, which is good, but I could be wrong. Do we need exclamation? Probably not. Do we need counting? Hmm. Numbers are helpful, but you could always spell them out. I don't know if we do punctuation. I think we leave that as is. We have our base alphabet. We need to figure out the rules of the language. What will the rules be? I have one of them already figured out, maybe. No, I don't like that. Let's see. Uh, ba -ba. Actually, I want to test. I hoped too much. Ariel. 
Language, grammar rules. One. First rule. Certain parts. And within a double circle. Go to in cases of colon or semicolon use a go is added with the words. Oh. Okay, so that gives us clear instances as to where the lettering itself goes, as well as where um, how you do more complex grammar. Next. Three. Sure that I'm using this word correctly. Okay. Three. No. No. Portmanteaus. She. Fireball equals ball of fire. This will give you a longer phrasing for simpler things, as well as um, be very clear. Oops. Four. Fourth rule. Let's see what else. We got something that gives us a circle and a second circle, if need be. A, the third rule gives us how it is generally written for the written part. Fourth rule. So now we have we have a rule for the circles. Oops. Gosh, I wish I could draw circles. And then we have our rule for the writing that was in the circle. What would be the rule for the geometric shapes? we would need geometric shapes. Otherwise, it's not really a spell circle. It's just a 
circle circle words in it a uh, a spell donut magic donut no oh, i need to not think about that donuts sound too good right what would give us this because i was considering having it be like a number of points or lines equal to the number of like nouns in the phrase i was thinking of this in the context of casting a spell if you write this out if you're casting a fireball spell you would say something like uh ignite a ball of fire colon or not colon um Ignite a ball of fire, send it forward at this speed, blah, blah, blah. Ew. Thank you, shoulder. So, that would give a lot of... But it wouldn't give any reason for you to have lines in particular. The problem is, I was also I was also considering like having it be way more complexly constructed, where you had to just group nouns and verbs together. So like you put a noun and then surround it with synonyms, and you put a verb and surround it with synonyms, and you try to do this evenly, and then you draw lines between all of them, but then you're never gonna get an even one, like never. Unless you meticulously plan out your word choice. Which seems a little much. Kind of makes sense. But, like, in regards to a lore thing, it doesn't make sense for... actually using it. I would like it to be usable. So why would it have lines? What would be a good source of the lines? Um... How many times the letter E appears? Um... I could have the shapes in the center be... specific to something. have an idea Oops. Okay, I need to take my glove off so I can do this. So if we have it, so that the number of um, points, or whatever, has to do with what is being referred to, like the scope of the sentence. Three, three lines is line rules. Number indicates the slash uh, perspective of the circle. Three lines, 
first person slash self. Four lines. Second person. Self from other view. Hello, cool. Thank you for the uh, the, the tag and also congrats on your 30 stream streak. That's a big one. How you doing? I must hit stop streaming. No, it had been bad. Third person. Okay, and then... And then we have... Subject being such inanimate that gives us a reason to have the lines and gives us useful information about the sentence. Got home from the nine hour round trip for face electrocution. How's your face feeling? On fire and smooth, perhaps? Six lines must be immediately within circle A apply to seven. Mostly just pain and soreness. Fun. Everyone loves pain and soreness. Um, symbol you act as a signature signature oh, but we circles. Eight circles intersecting the main circles can be used as a sort of um for instance. Mostly just pain and soreness, 
But soon, soon it will be smooth. How much longer are they having you do this? How close are you to your goals? Parentheses. optional for those. I'm sure how many more, but it's down to 90 minutes with two sets of stabbings for numbing. Ooh. A cow pun vanilla. You must be utterly insane to ask me for cow puns. Are you just a milking me for funs? Oh, co crow pun. I'm sorry. I missed the R. I. Either way, congratulations, you got free cow puns. Or crow puns. Uh. I don't know whether or not I can figure that out. And also, I apologize for any coughing. I might have COVID 19. We're not sure. I haven't been tested. I don't know exactly what it is. I am not coughing into your face. How you doing, Vanilla? How you been? Ooh, a little witch in the woods. I think, I think I saw you, but I was working on something at the time. Uh, did you enjoy your witchery? Should be done hopefully this year, though. Each time cuts down on minutes. Ooh. That's good. I just set my smudge guard in my condensation from my cup. Lovely. Oh, uh, what other rules will we need for this? Yeah, is Choco doing it? That's the vanilla. Let's see. Do we need any other rules? This gives us circles. Forces a certain kind of length to the writing. The reason to have lines. Adding a central symbol. Is that acceptable for grammar? Don't mind, I won't get sick. What if you do get sick? I don't want you to get sick. You must protect the small bean. Okay, and I think I will need a... at least a period in the... We use the period. Uh... Needs to be something simple, so why not? Oh, that's that's too simple. Periods at the top. That's a fun little thing, a little quirk. And yeah, Vanilla, I made the lettering, and then we have the grammar rules, and then I, I'm going to, using these grammar rules, make a thing. I am sorry, Vanilla, but no. That's the Vanilla. Sets on top of tablet, yes. So vanilla, when are you when are you making your own your own spider language? You can make a language that's based on like web structure. That'd be cool.
You're literate. You, you sure? I guess technically it's Choco that plays the uh, the all the boy love uh games. Also, that means that Vanilla, you need to learn to read and write. Really enjoying. Thank you. I'm extra tired today, so I have given myself extra eye bags. I'm tired. I got. I got five hours of sleep today. But I woke up in pain and should have slept more, but I couldn't. So I had to do things. Suffering. So, I need to demonstration, edit, canvas size to way too big. In fact, I think that made my computer unhappy in a second. Performance. Uh, no, it's actually doing fine, surprisingly. Okay. Language grammar rules. These go down here. Okay. This eh. will go in here as well. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, Vanilla, but there's no taking it easy when the body decides you are awake and... That's it. That's... You, you don't have any option. We're just awake now. Playing on the face electrocution table seems to have fixed the side pain from yesterday, though. Nice. Also, don't... Why are you staying late all week? Thank you for the hydrate, vanilla. Ah. So, now... I guess there's nothing to do but test our structure, yeah? Okay, this, this is lettering, and we need Ah, pardon me. So we have our double circle. What are we going to have it say? Does anyone have any ideas on what we're going to make this circle say? Get my face electrocuted now. It's 100 degrees. Wait, that sounds bad. And you can't, you can't put sunscreen on, can you? Because of all of the injuries. Oh no. Oh dear. Just a second, if anyone has a 
sentence that they want me to see if I can write in this. I would love to see it. Ow, I sat down too hard. Drops to 80s just by driving too hard. Lovely. Cool's brain empty. Vanilla has fallen asleep in the feathers. Got lost in the sauce. Sif is doing things. That means I have to think of a sentence myself. Alright, let's see. What would we need? Or say fireball. Let's use magic for the magic circle example. So Okay, so using our rules. We have no portmanteaus. No. I'm gonna make you put something like Burb is a wonderful artist and a great person. No! Let's see, what would be the steps to make fireball? First, create fire. Second, shape fire. Third, move fire. Fourth, have fire go kaboom. Do we create the fire? Do we just say create fire? Why not? We are making an instruction list for a fireball. Create a ball of fire. In circle. The sickle. I guess it's less a sentence and it would end up being more of a paragraph. No, it would have to be a sentence. No, it wouldn't. It'd be kind of a paragraph. A ball of fire within the circle. Uh -huh. Press the ball of fire. Expel a ball of fire. I don't know. We'll just say upward. Upward is a kind of a portmanteau, but the problem is, is... Fire in... In the direction of up. Uh, 
the place the compressed fire upon him. So we have our sentence. Now we need to turn it into a circle. Which means I... I need to write it. Suffering and dispel. Which means I need to uh, save duplicate PNG. I'm going to basically export it so that I can open it up on another screen to reference while I am writing. Ah. After I very quickly check if there is a way to write a long A circle in CSV. Yep, between the end and character, so I'll make the selection, throw a selected layer. And the layer palette into the material palette? There's a material palette? Excuse? You hold on. We're learning things here. Window. What does it mean here? Oh, I see. Oh, gosh. Oh, dear. That's how to do it. Hold on. So if I just... Sorry, one second. I am learning things. So, do this. Edit. Transform. Ooh. Filter. Or coordinates. Oh, ooh, I'm learning so much. 
This is gonna be mildly a nightmare. Ooh, it does make it... Mm, mm, okay. Cancel. Cancel. This is fine. So basically what we're gonna do is... You know... 8 by 8 Good. And then we are going to take this, put it here. And do some shenanigans while I open up that one image. Where is it? There. Magic circle lettering right there. Make it a little bigger so I can see properly. Do that, and that gives us exactly what we need for the lettering. Okay, so we have D or E. I wish I could, like, not do this terribly. The hardest part of this is going to be my handwriting. Prize. The line to follow. The A. Wait for it to auto save. A T. A Would it be easier to just make this into a font? Yes. Yes, it would. B for ball. F. 
left. I... Are E <laughs> Hello, Yuko, how you doing? This verb going to make it into a font though. Maybe? No. Uh, I'd have to look up how to do that. Because <clears throat> the only way I've ever made a font is in Fontstruct. Love you, I... T, where's T? T, oh, Canley, thank you for the raid and welcome, raiders. I am Aresima. How did your stream go? You were just chatting, having a chat. I hope it went well. Also, hello, I'm a harpy. I have wings and bird legs, and I'm making a language right now. But more accurately, already made one, and I'm testing. Thank you for the save check, Vanilla. I need to mostly just save this one. Save as... Magic circle language. There we go. We need Hello, I have Ibans. Playing Hell Divers with partners. How's you? I'm doing all right. I am working on this language because he each I N uh, T H Circle, uh, I are are uh, see L Yeah. 
There is a single sentence. Almost. Also, this would 100% be significantly easier if I just turn this into a font. Probably would take less time. Because I need... This is gonna look... Messy. Very messy. In the period, which is book. So long. And drawing each individual letter. Ugh. Hold on, let me just cry a little bit. Yeah. Those are all within acceptable tolerances, except this one. I just make a font. Oh, right, all the font software is paid. Because we don't have free font software that is easy to use. <sighs> so I guess I am writing it out. E O. M. E. Now we've entered the area where, because my text has different kerning, I have to. Q or not Q R E S. 
Uh, <laughs> it cries. H. E. I'm gonna have this language memorized by the time I finish the circle, I swear. B. But, but, e. 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 A L L I'm cheating. Okay. Uh, do 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 given. This is repeated over and over. Uh, and then period. <sighs> Why did I have to make it so verbose? Because it needs a lot of symbols to look nice. Why I did it. But still, I'm not happy about it. Eh. First X. P. E. L The the power of cheating. Direction D.
the eye. R. E. C. T. I. Oh, and action of O F first F, I think. of up <sighs> U P uh. On the bright side, I feel excessively nerdy for all of this. That's good. Yeah. Thank you for Sarah's draw the special. Everyone, please drink some water. You are excessively nerdy for this? Yay! I'm going to take this as an opportunity to really quick put my hair up so I stop dying. Love it back. Uh, let's see if I can do this right again. He's no die. That's why I'm trying to get my hair up. Do, do, do. Am I putting it up enough? Probably. I failed. Try one more time. Do this, please. Preferably without stabbing myself. Nope. I 
figured out a way to put up my hair with a hairpin. It's not working. So I guess I just suffer through uh, being hot cries. Oh well. That's fine. It's okay. I had it secure. It was just too tight. So. Oh, thank you, Sif. Are you okay? You you, you kind of type in like you're a little a little drunk drunkish. You really eat, you should go to bed. At least lie down. Uh, release. Where's the? Don't take that as an instruction. Or do. Do whatever you want. Release. R L Where's L? E A S Place V Compressed. Ah. Oh. Is the C O M? R E S S E D Pressed fire F I R Fire upon Oh. On impact. I am he A C. T. 
aquí. Period. All right. Uh, merge visible layers. Oops. Merge layer below. There we are. Stretch it to fit. Won't make it look any different, really. Stretch it to fit. Also, it look fine. And then copy that. Filter, correction, no distort. Polar coordinates. That makes it very small. Your eyes. Huh, oh, that's interesting. Rectangular to polar. A filter, distort, oh dear, polar coordinates. No, thank you for subscribing for 33 months. Wow. What are you doing? How did drawing go last night? And don't worry, I remember I will be poking you. See about the thing at some point. So I think I actually need it to be like here. Filter, distort, polar coordinates. No. Filter, distort, polar coordinates. Okay. Copy. Paste. But why is it? Oh, that's why. Yeah, how you doing now? It's fun, not very confident in drawing still. Madam, you are an amazing artist. Please, have confidence. The sheer number of people that I would sacrifice to have your skill is a lot. There's that. Oops. Uh, and then we can get rid of this. And then uh, per the rules, this would be a third person sentence. So we would have five lines. The main subject is inanimate. Which I actually need to fix that. Rules. So it says which one is which. I feel like animate would be. No sacrificing, you're too late. Hundreds are dying. As we speak. 
But no, I think that your art is wonderful. Like your your digital art, it feels like I'm looking at a painting, like a, a professionally made painting. And your pen drawings, ah. Like, ah, yes, this is the kind of doodle that I would expect to see, like, from a multi-published mangaka. Like, you, your art is good. At least from my perspective. Uh, does it matter that the... and the text, it doesn't matter which way the text goes. Not really. Does it matter? It does matter. It's bothering me. Uh. Delete. Delete. Control Z. Eh, flip it. Okay, filter. Sort. Color coordinates. Okay. Copy, paste. No, that is not it. Inverse select area, box. Uh, because it's off thing, okay. I have to manually do this because it's doing a dumb. Do it. Do it. Do it. Circle. Okay, okay. Next. We have... Five lines. Cross lines. We are making a pentacle. Eh. Polygon. I can make a. Wait, no. This is. Wait, yes. Hold on. Figure number of corners. Five. A little. Okay, there's our sketch. Air quotes. This. Oh, here. Here. Boop. Two. Here. Boop. Here, boop. Here, boop. Here, boop. Hmm. The temptation to make it double line. Hmm. Yes, yes. Double lines for fancy. Uh, 
ba -ba -ba -ba. I'm going to do that is that and this and that and this and that and this and that and this that's wrong see And me, thank you. All right, try this again. There, 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 nope, there, there. 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 Get rid of that. Increase the edge width. Two. No. There. Drop it below the circle. Rasterize it for the sake of my sanity. Erase the overshoot. Is this pointless? Yes. Did I do it? Yes. Does that make me strain? I'm not even gonna try to do the center thing. Anyway, so we have my dumb little thing. As a point, because you did it. Yay! I made a constructed language. Beautiful, lovely. Yay! Anyway, there we go. We have a constructed language. Magic circles. It's very basic. Does it technically need the circle? No. Does the circle have a point? Kind of. But this is a very simple s s sentence or paragraph. So. I don't want to do a double circle. That was a pain to write. But now I have this. Mel, do you like constructing languages? I've made two now, and I'm in pain. I hardly used the first one, and now I have two. Never tried to make one. Just do it. Make a, make a language. It's fun. You can just have it be the same as English, but just different letters. You don't wanna. 
But then you could write in the you can make a language that some of your OCs actually write and speak in. So you could like actually write in how they would write. Wouldn't that be cool? Wouldn't that be awesome? Wouldn't that just be fun? Do that. Every OC. They speak in grunts? Oh, I see. It's those kind of OCs. Oh my. You good, Mel? I didn't know you were into that. Oh dear. So this can go away because it's in the thing. This can go away because it was just for that. And now we have magic circle. Change canvas. that so that I will always have it and an example a very basic example that took two hours No one's going to know what this means. I'll leave it up while I go find the thing I was going to work on. And actually, I'm going to take a second and go to the bathroom. B R B.
Fuck. Hello. I did it. I went to the bathroom all by myself. Where'd my pen go? There it is. And now, I am not BRB anymore, and I can go find that file of the thing I want to work on, maybe. Make sure that it is acceptable for Twitch. It should be. But I'm a little paranoid, perhaps. Just a little. Because Twitch do be kind of stinky sometimes. So I will hide. This real quick. Just to make sure that it's not being dumb. Or I'm not being dumb. It should be fine, right? I should be fine. Alright. And now we draw... Big Titty Corrupted Elf thing. Yeah. I don't think one of them is considered a tag. Also, are her legs too long? They are a little too long. Real big bodonk, some real bodon honkeros. A real set of tongue hongala coogs. Real question is how many people immediately left stream and how many people joined stream? Uh, let's see. I need to figure out what her eyes look like, and then I need to figure out what the rest of her clothes look like. And her shoes. Don't look forward to the shoes. Yeah, come on, cool. Everyone should get that reference. Hello, Ryan Song. Welcome back. The elf. Uh, what eye shape am I going to give her? One cool. Do you know any crazy characters? I need references. Is this the one for the game? No, it's not for the game. It, wait, what game? Hold on. 
What game are you talking about? Also, do you know of any characters who are, you know, your game? The tabletop game? This is not for the tabletop. This is for, this is a different one of my original characters. My most endowed and probably my craziest character. Let's see. I'm looking for eye shapes. That shape here mm -hmm. so her head is at this angle which means Yu-Gi-Oh, what's the best hand tra I don't know. I don't play Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm a Magic the Gathering player. So, uh, yeah. Bomba or Eriko? I don't know who Bomba is. Riddle Devil Story. Oh, she's the one with the reaction image I use. Ooh. She has good eyes. Erko from Prequene. Definitely, definitely closer to. Bomba. What's a good Magic Arena Vampire sweatshirt deck? I don't know. I don't know half those terms. I also don't play Magic Arena. So... I am like, I have not played Magic in a couple blocks, and I play tabletop or real Magic, so physical magic. I don't know. I have no idea. So for Bomba, it's kind of like this. Mm 
aquí y... This is acceptable. Now, if only I could actually, like, draw. Motoya also has a few good looks from Riddle Devil. Bombo is one of my all-time favorites. Too super, the use of trauma and DID, plus the fact she ends up as one of the two closest people from killing the girl. I don't know what it's about. I... should I watch it? Oh, so there's a real significant, uh difference in aesthetics here between those two faces. Uh, let's see. 17 assassins enter a classroom. One of them is the target that must die. First to kill the target wins and gets their wish granted. Oh. I'm going to assume they don't know the target.
I don't know the target, but only one of them is happy and doesn't smell blood. Best assassin immediately gaze for the target and swears, I see. Is the crazy one also, also a lesbiab? Crazy one ends up the lesbian maid of the pompous rich girl. So what you're saying is simple concept that kind of gets uh, entirely drowned out with the craziness of the anime. Is that about right? Sketch a bit larger. What? I am frozen for a second. I have to check something. One moment, I have to go do things in regards to legal documents. Yabby. Again, apologies, I'm sorry. Where's my... Where is it? Where's my BRB? There it is. Be right back.
I am back, sorry. I need to assign something, and then it turned into a conversation. And someone trying to get me to go swimming. Ah. Oh. I think I was just gone for a couple minutes. How do I draw feet? <laughs> How do I draw clothing? How do I draw eyes? How do I draw stuff? Uh, how angry do I want to make her? Swimming at this hour, I just want to be burp -kini. Oh, thank you for the watch, Shrink Zero. And not now, is plans for later, but for reasons, I will not be swimming. Those reasons can be guessed. Have you watched Dungeon Meshi? Yes. Yes, I have. Please, please, Mel. I need you to ramble about Dungeon Meshi, because I know you want to. I know that there is a reason for that question. Do it. Ramble. Because it's really late? Uh, no, Zira. Because of the the issues that I have in meat space. No, in the IRL world. My physical projection. Wondering if you have OC. I do not have a dungeon meshy OC. I don't have many OCs in uh, established... Like, in other people's uh, universes. I have plenty in my own. But none, none for dungeon meshy. Mm -hmm. Once this week finishes, cool will be binging meshy and for your and a few others. You gotta watch it. You gotta watch it. You have to see Fallen. Ah, uh, she's so cute. I get that I only started making fan mosies recently, and it's fun, but I never know what I'm doing. Just make mosies. Just have fun with it. I'm unsurprised you've seen Fallen. Given there's a lot of fan art of Fallen. For some reason, why would there be so much fan art of this particular character, I wonder? Mel, also, I, I was curious, because I you are one of the people I know with the most. How many original characters do you have, if I may ask? It looks so close to the show until the close-up. Like only the close up is where it like falls apart a little bit. It's good. So good. And the worm elf agrees. To.
Du, du, du. Gave up counting work for half three hundred. Well, why have you not written like an entire book series? And also, are those all like named and designed, at least in your head, characters with backstory? What about the me space issues? Eh. Shrug. How life goes. I'm doing the best that I can, and if that means I can't go swimming, I can't go swimming. Oh well. Yes, all of them have the... Oh, dear. That's so many. I don't think you're weird. I just... I thought that I had a lot. And I am learning I do not. You change like five times. What? Oh yeah, Mela's. Yeah, you've only changed once. Not including outfits. Because you did change your outfit a lot. I will forever remember the butterfly. I do like your current design a lot, though. I prove. It's very fitting. How do I draw shoes? Someone teach me how to draw shoes. <laughs> I didn't even think to give her... I didn't even give myself guides for her feet. Crap. Oh, that sketch isn't going to be helpful in the slightest. Hey. Okay, perspective must be kept in mind. <laughs> People like the butterfly more, so I'm glad you like this one. I like both of them. I am not I am not drawing her barefoot. She is not barefoot. She in fact at least in the past, because I'm redesigning her outfit, in the past had uh, boots that went just under her knee. Ugh. No feet, internet cries. Sorry, one sec here. I will give you, I'll give you the feet you oh so desire.
There you go. Eat. Yep. I need someone to somehow figure out a way to take that out of context of Mel saying that feet are cute. And then post it all over Twitter. Thank you. Okay, so that's the general shape of foot. But Mel, you said feet are cute. And as internet law states, that means you have a foot fetish. And that you just admitted it. You outed yourself. I'm writing a twit longer as we speak. The world will know. That's that long, so it should be slightly shorter. Here. I have made the foot too... Uh, I hate drunk feet. Like, I, I really hate drawing feet. Like, really, really hate it. Because it's a pain in the butt. A massive pain in the butt, and I don't like it. And 
And do I have the perspective wrong? Yes, I do. Even though I have a foot phobia. I forgot you had that. I am just teasing though. And thank you, Mel. Still, I I like yours so much. It makes me happy every time I see yours. This is not the right perspective in the slightest. I'm just gonna do that. And cry. Uh -uh. I hate drawing feet. I hate drawing feet. Hands are hands, feet are the real evil. It's true. Feet are the real evil. Because, uh. like, hands look a little weird. Feet look demonic. They're just evil. So did I just accidentally, like, almost properly get the proportions right dang i did almost get the proportions right the problem is it should actually be longer her is too short. I still feel like this is in the wrong perspective. Problem is, can I fix it just by squishing? And the answer is no. <clears throat> is it in the wrong perspective or is this one in the wrong perspective? Should be pointing down slightly, so we should actually see more of the top of her foot here. Which we can just kinda... kinda... Smudge a little bit by doing that and by doing that. And then move the sketch up a little bit and clean, eh, clean this up. <clears throat> Uh, 
That's a little better. Uh, da -da -da -da. <clears throat> Thank you, Rush, for the hydrate, posture check, hand stretch, and safe check. How you doing? I'm struggling with feet. Uh, no finger pops today. Uh, Tired as heck. Make me sad, my inability to enjoy smoking and or drinking. I mean... Pat, 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 pat. Pat's the rush. Is her other leg still too short? So from knee to ankle, yeah, that's about right for, for a short knee. At the very least, it looks better. Uh, speaking of drinking, opens up bottle of alcohol. Uh, I would potentially consider, if not for the fact that no. Thank you, Mel. I have watered. I am now Soggy Bird. I can no longer fly. If a predator comes by, that'll be the that'll be it for me. That'll be the end. We've done this. You people with your hydrate redeem have sentenced me to death by house cat. <laughs> Or something. Too moist to fly.
No. Uh, Uh, sorry, Burbo, help with watering. Thank you. Everybody in chat, please drink water. It has been redeemed, and as such, you have entered a social contract in order to drink water. Hydrate yourselves. Please. And no, alcohol doesn't count. Because I know someone is going to ask. Mel saying okay, about to go chug Everclear. The secret alcoholism coming forth. Oh, if you are still here, do you still have pig plushie? Never. Okay. I need to technically make these larger than her feet because I made them the exact same size as her feet. see. I end up, I'm in Japanese mode again for some reason. So weird to hear social contract outside class. Hee <laughs> hee. Egg plush? No, pig. But Bartholomew? Is that his name? Kuma, why? Yes. Are you giving him many, many hugs? Good, good. It seemed like the perfect size for sleeping with. Like, hug pillow size, but not as long. Yes. It's about the same size as a, uh, Blahai. Kuma, why? Why are you warning me? What, what if didn't prepare for raid, huh? Then people would see giant elf titty. And that's not the type of content artist creator that I am. It's... This is an original character of mine, of course it is. Thank you for the raid, Sapphire Slayer, and welcome raiders. Kuma has outed you. So I apologize for the lack of surprise on my face. Blame Kuma. I'll offer you pitchforks and torches. 
But welcome, raiders. How was your stream? If you are not going through ads currently... Give a second. Hello, Sapphire. Welcome. Assuming you are through the ads now, how did your stream go? And also, hello, raiders. I am a Resima, a harpy. I have wings and bird legs, and we are drawing things. Great, but exhausting. How long did you go for? And also, how far are you in Borderland? Oh, I did you? Okay. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. I appreciate it very much. Uh, am I going to make these books look? Hmm. Oh yeah, we're drawing an original character of mine, and I'm designing her clothes at the moment. And also we created a a language earlier that is a magic circle language. Only five hours. Five hours is a long stream, especially if you've had a long day beforehand. That is a stream to be very proud of. A new friend of yours, Kuma. Well, welcome, a friend of a friend. I do hope you enjoy your time here. And also, please make sure to get water, food, rest as you need it, especially after a long day. And thank you. I have worked very hard over many years to become the mildly acceptable artist that I am. And also, because Mel is here, I am going to shout them out. They are also an artist, and her art's so good. Get wrecked, Mel. Get destroyed. <laughs> oh, sorry, one sec. Uh, uh, uh. Bwahaha! My evil plan come to fruition! That was your one. I'm going to leave your stream up, but I'm falling asleep. Go get your rest. People will have wonderful dreams. And again, thank you for the raid. I appreciate it immensely. And Kuma, assuming you are the one who guided them here. Thank you. Mel, when are you going to learn how to do a train whistle, but without the train whistle? You can? Okay. Well, then when are you going to learn how to make recorder sounds without a recorder? Thank you, Kuma. I am just looking at boots right now to decide what the top of these boots are going to look like. And let me tell you, trying to find non-heeled boots that don't go up to mid-thigh, although I could do thigh boots. All right then, no. When are you going to learn how to caw? Doing thigh boots. Then...
And we do it like this. Uh, you see, Cole, those are close to Chihuahua noises, but your more accurate Chihuahua noise is going to be that kind of noise. Hummingbird. I see. Thank you, Kuma. Why a second, I need water. Come on now, answer the question for us, please. It would be appreciated. We would like to know more of your lore. Why not? Do you not like when I talk like this to you? Hmm? You know, it's just so I want you to be comfortable and relaxed. Are you not comfortable and relaxed? Mel, does this look like the face of mercy to you? Satin, comfortable and relaxed? Good. Very good.
Oh, Mel, darling, why are you crying? Okay, you're safe here. No one's going to hurt you. Give me an artist to pay for Burboshi. What do you mean? You're entirely safe, Mel. Don't worry. We've been friends for so long, after all. I apologize, cool. I cannot give you an artist, for I don't know anyone who makes anything animated. That was my chair, honest. Also, I am entirely just kind of winging it for this. Time to poke a spider. Hmm. You keep saying reassuring things like that. I'm cooling the reactor and entering sleep mode. You are safe here. No one can harm you. No one can trouble you. Life's worries can't reach you here. It's only you. Me. The rest of us. Everyone here. Together. Comfortable. Relax. There is nothing bad in this space, only comfort.
Thank you for gifting a sub, Zira. I appreciate it. Congratulations to Wee Renegade. Yes, Pat's good. I hope you're all comfortable and relaxed. If you're not, you only need to tell me and I will handle the problem for you. Drops redeem on mute, doesn't elaborate, leaves. Yeah, race car, hmm. So do I, am I just going to be stuck using like this voice for the next five hours? Hmm. I know you all enjoy it, but I really All right. I don't know what else.
sure if that was a good one or a bad one. Uh, it didn't dislocate, I don't think. If it did, it was just a moment. I'm not sure. Hmm. Probably not good that I'm not sure. I should probably be aware of that. Oh well. What else? Now I need to finish her top. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I'll just let you stare at this, and I will mumble to myself while I go look at references. Welcome to character creation. Design more accurately. Let's see. Oh, there's me getting distracted by seeing something that is entirely unrelated. I'm trying to pick the color of my dungeon messy OC now. Give me strength. I sadly cannot give you strength. You are asking a harpy. We aren't known for that. I can give you speed, though. Pick now. Mel, pick now. Hurry, quickly. You can't let it sit this long. The colors are going to expire. You have to pick one. Somebody's already making one in a color that you're wanting. Come on, you can do it. Pick a color. Come on. Come on, you can do it right now. Come on. Can't let it sit this long. Someone's going to take all the colors from you, and then there will be none left. You have to pick a color right now. Come on, you can do it. Mel, what kind of red? Are we talking like a warm red or a cooler red? More of a purple, a wine, an osher, hmm? ochre, auburn, scarlet. If pick, come on. Rose red. There's so many red. Blood red, a classic. But Mel, what's the accent color going to be? Because you can't make it all one color. You have to pick something else. What other color? Come on, you have to think. What color is the trim going to be? Their hair. What's their accent color going to be? You can do it. Can't be red. If it's red, it'll just blend in. Sorry, in searching for references, I found an image I have to send to somebody. Because it is Marcel from Dungeon Meshi as... Uh, what Fallen is, but a parakeet instead of a... instead of white. Red and purple, an interesting choice. I do hope that you'll find a way to balance those colors in a way that contrasts properly, but gives an acceptable amount of vibrancy. Good job, Mel. The 
And this is how you give an artist extreme anxiety, but get them to make a decision faster than they ever have before. Uh -uh. Let's see. I have to give her something around her, like her neck or collar, but I don't know what. I'm so sorry if I gave you anxiety, Mel. Pat, pat. worked your drawing good do keep drawing and i would love to see it if when i would love to see it when it's done if you were willing to show or if you post it on on the place that is forever twitter i will probably see it Post on bird app occasion. I'm excited. The bird app that is no longer the bird app. Sadly. Mm -mm. And we just call the sketch done. We could call the sketch done. Or I could just add the thing around the neck later. We'll do that. Ah, uh, yes, that's the line weight I want. I wish to do the line work at this size of line. Mm -hmm.
That will speed up your line work. Indeed it will. I'll have to make a single line and then we are done. Thank you for the lurk, Kuma. Thank you for coming by.
all of the things more or less done. Must a single hair slip free of my headphones and absolutely go after my eye? Why could it not go anywhere else? No, it had to go for the eye. Uh, everything keeps going all quiet and I keep zoning out. I think that may mean that you need rest, cool. You know, sleep. That thing that you haven't been getting enough of. Oh. 
that hyper-focused burb is nice to look at. And you are looking at me. I don't know if I'm hyper-focused. I'm just being quiet. I don't know what to say. And I got quiet in chat. Thus, I draw in silence for a moment. Uh, arm. I wish I could set my tablet in a slightly better spot, but alas, I cannot. Oh dear, Mirrod Ong, thank you for the raid, I appreciate it, and welcome raiders. How was your stream? Ooh, Hades too. How did it go? Did you get a win in? Also, hello, raiders. My name is Arasima. I am a, a harpy with various wings and bird feet. Welcome. We are drawing and made a language today. We did not beat boss three for the first time. Very nice. Sounds like good progress. 
think you'll be able to next time you play. Oh dear. Thank you, Mirrored Onk, for subscribing with Prime. I appreciate it very much. I'll cross my fingers and hope for the best. I will do the same for you. Mm -hmm. Also, we are drawing for her. Why, thank you. This is a character of mine. Foldable? All right, time to line the Clearly, the focus of the image. Why did I have to give her frills the last minute? Oh dear. And also, Ankh, please do make sure you take care of yourself. If you need to, get food, water, rest, whatever you need. These things are important.
Uh, art streams are always good chill vibes. I'm glad. That's what I go for here. Comfy, relax. Thank you all. Hello, Charlie. How you doing? I can only wonder why you have decided to use the Licky Moat right now. Doing pretty good, use them all the time. I see, I see. Just so happened to coincide, right? I fear I will have to be right back again. It 
seems I had too much water today. Be back soon. Let Charlie lick the screen too much. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine, and you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine, and you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand.
I'm back. I'm sorry. That was a little bit. I wish I had a heart monitor on, cause uh, I thought I had to go to the bath. I I thought I had to pee, drink too much water. I go to the bathroom. Yeah, this will be fine. It'll be quick. And I close the door. And then boss music started playing. And then I had to fight for my life. And it's not over. So this is me telling you that I will be back as soon as I can. I will be fine. I'll just be back as soon as I can. It might be 10 to 15 minutes. Sorry.
Okay, I'm back. Uh... I am sorry for that. I have survived. Barely. Ugh. I hate that this is a not uncommon occurrence. Uh. Why my tummy so angry? Thank you, Kuma. Everyone, please drink water. Uh. Did you have fun with the sound alert school? Uh. <clears throat> uh. I hate that so much. I'm fine. And then I walk into the bathroom and then I am not fine. And then everything is not fine. You didn't... Did I say Kuma? I meant cool. Oh man. Fix! Fix. There were none in the bathroom. Thankfully. Tummy. They woke me up from my small nap. Oh no. Wait, Kuma, did you fall asleep at your desk? I saw a meme about trans women and IBS the other day. Oh no. Send it, cool. Come on, share. I'm not diagnosed with IBS, but I wouldn't be surprised to say the least. Uh, it's real.
Uh, also, Kuma, napping at your desk is probably not good. It's probably better if you, like, napped in your bed. You know? Can't bring my headset to bed? I mean, you could. Or Kuma, you could consider getting a bed headset. A bed set, even. Wouldn't that be cool? I think I'm gonna take a break from drawing. Switch over to a game. Because my arm is starting to hurt and pain and suffering. This is probably the best hair that I've done though, in a while at least. Not happy with these bits, but shrug, they'll do for now. Don't need to fix the back too. But like this part, I'm happy with all this. This looks, this, this makes me happy. We'll save, we will finish the big Tibby elf at a later juncture. I do not look forward to doing all of the effects work on her that I have to do. And then drawing her second, second form. Yay, pets. Cool doesn't remember which server it's in. No, cool. Why? Wow. Hello. I am not big. And I can stare at you menacingly. This. And I can, I don't know, show you my still empty room. It's still dusty. I still have yet to dust it. You don't mind, right? You're not allergic to dust, right? You are. I hope you have Benadryl. Uh, otherwise, it's gonna be a bad time for you. Oh, there goes Ankh. It's the beginning of the end. Ankh won't survive. I won't survive because I feel my tummy being like, hey, guess what? Round three. You wanna go again? No, I don't, Tummy. Please, no. But you might have to. 
I'm not going to give you a choice if I decide you're gonna. Would I want a choice? I don't want to have to do that right now. Well, too bad. You're going to have to. I am a... Well, 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 uh... Well-adjusted individual. Hmm. Alright, that's it, Kuma. I'm going right here. This is an entirely different kind of stream now. Perfectly hmm. 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 Where are you going, Burr, Kuma? It, it is banned, I believe. I might just have to end early, because, like, legitimately, I'm going to have to leave again. I'm annoyed. I know it looks like I'm smiling, but I'm annoyed. I apologize. I'm sorry, Milago, but I am not going to smile because I'm annoyed because I think I'm going to have to end stream because my tummy has decided to wage war on me. I'm annoyed. Stream. <clears throat> There we go. Is that an acceptable call? Uh, okay. I'm just gonna end stream. I'm sorry. I feel bad. Both in the emotional sense and the physical sense. <sighs> We're going to raid, though. It's how it goes sometimes, Onk. My body likes to betray me in the worst ways. Thank you for following, Deoxtu. Welcome, and I apologize. I'm about to end because my tummy's mad. But welcome. I hope you enjoy your time here. Eh. Move this real quick. And suddenly he's to have slightly more urgency. <laughs> I throw you all at Kuro because we were drawing, and while well, Kuro is not drawing, one of Saf's admin's bots. Ah, welcome. I hope you are doing all right. And I do apologize, but yes, I am ending. Kuroya. Alright, we will be raiding Kuroya. He is a fellow crow, though he is a Tengu, not a harpy. I am informed that he does not in fact lay eggs on account of, according to him, air quotes, being male. Anyway, I don't get it, but um Yeah, he's a crow. And do take care, everybody. I hope to see you all again soon. I will be streaming on Tuesday, as my schedule dictates. 
Uh, hopefully for the full time this time. I'm sorry. <laughs> I will commit Sudoku in the meantime. Have a good evening, everyone. Take care. Raid message is, as always, caw incessantly. You can either type it or use the emote for the calling. Caw, caw, caw. And yeah, good night, everybody. Take care. And bye bye. Goodbye. Bye bye. Goodbye. 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 And farewell, everyone.